So there is another viral video of Hamari. The video link is pinned in the comments. Go see, come back and tell me your thoughts. But her mom had this to say about the video. And this is why I can't be nice. People do anything for clout, including my child. Shorty can't get right. Please stop tagging me. I don't give a F. Pissed off is an understatement. I've always told my child to take up for herself, but there's a proper way to do everything. And that wasn't it. Not worried, just more instilling I have to do with her. Now, when it comes to the video, I was a little thrown off. A lot of people were sending me the clip where Nike was saying that her child does not cuss. And you have to understand Understand that children will be one person with their friends and then there will be another person with their parents. So of course Nike hasn't physically heard her curse. Do you allow Kamari to cuss? Yes, yes. <laughs> no. We are not friends. She's my daughter. She's only 10. And I think that's just a level of disrespect for the simple fact the house I was brought up in, we couldn't say shoot. We couldn't call my mama mother because it's too close to mother, you know the rest. Um, just simple things like that. She's not an adult. Let her be a kid and all the extra will come at age. So no, she is not allowed to cut. So the fact that so many people know her social media and that are coming for her, you know, you get aggravated after a while, but like Nike said, and I like how she took ownership and didn't blame anybody. She said, there's a little bit more instilling that she has to do. Now recently, Chloe Billy was upset because while she was performing, her tampon string was showing. And instead of people enjoying the entertainment, they were pointing out her situation. So here's what she had to say. To see the video, the link is down below as well. So this video is going viral on TikTok and this is one of the big conversations today. So Kylie Jenner ordered from Uber Eats under a fake name, but the guy who delivered her food recognized her house. Here's what he had to say. You guys, right when I think this whole Instacart thing is getting normal again, I literally last minute leave my house to go do an order. I get one all the way in West Hollywood. I Erewhon for $12. I'm driving to this person's house to go deliver it. And as I'm driving by, I see all the security and stuff. I'm like, wait, this house looks so familiar. Why? Because my best friend Jordy showed me this house and it's Kylie Jenner's house. And I'm like, wait, there's no way this can be Kylie Jenner's house. Like, I need to look it up. So I look it up online. It's Kylie Jenner's house. Kylie Jenner's Los Angeles house in the Homeby Hills. It's literally a $12 order for pepperoni. This have paid me more it's under the name of ashton so i'm guessing it's for her assistant or something but they said i can't leave it out that i have to call and I have to go through the gate i'm so nervous i'm shaking i swear i'm gonna see stormy outside she's gonna be like who are you you look poor i don't know i'm nervous you guys i am freaking out right now oh my gosh i don't know how i'm supposed to get in hi i have an order for ashton gotcha. is this kylie jenner's house all these hollywood tour buses keep stopping i went in there i was just in there not a big deal they should be asking for pictures of me because i just went in kylie's house you guys i'm shaking right now i just handed it to the guy and he was like hi is this for instacart and i was like yeah he's like cool i was like is this kylie jenner's house he's like yeah as all these hollywood buses are coming by he's like oh come with me just to bring it in there i literally walk with him the gate is closing behind me i'm walking through this little pathway with like a river beneath it and then i just leave it at the front door i get to look into the whole house i see all these assistants all these maids and shit i didn't see kylie i didn't see stormy but i swear i heard a baby scream Here's her response. She said, if you don't know what I'm talking about, just carry on. But the fact that she commented is the reason why people wanted to know what she was talking about. She said, no one comes through the gate, which I believe. Because when he talked to the security guard, the video after that cut. So I don't think he went through the gate. The lying for attention rubs me the wrong way. Recipe coming soon, LOL. Because she did use the food that she ordered and she cooked the meal. And that's why people were saying that this possibly could be true. Because the food that she was eating was similar to what the guy delivered. I didn't I ordered this myself. He was tipped through the app. Lied to about seeing through my windows and hearing my son cry. Now, Kylie Jenner lives in a mansion. I doubt you're gonna hear a baby cry from outside. So, you know, he was just overly exaggerating, but I think the fact that she was eating the food that he delivered, that it possibly could be true because people are so eager to hear something about her son being that this is the new child in town. Well, the new child in town for the Kardashians. So I think that's why it blew up as much as it did but it was funny it was cute now yesterday doordash had a glitch in their system and people were able to get multiple things for free like it's almost like i don't know if they put a discount code in or soon as you go to checkout it says zero or it discounted you a lot of money but people were buying tvs people were buying apple products people were buying <laughs> it was just crazy it was crazy someone tweeted after they saw the picture of the girl with the tv they said nah the girl that ordered a tv from doordash might be on the news tomorrow a lot of people are saying that this might turn into a case but I don't think so because it, it's a problem on their end not so much the people in people are just taking advantage of the moment but I don't think anything is gonna happen I don't know y'all leave y'all comments down below let me know what y'all thinking when it comes to that